Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. And now I have Ripple news updates for you but also we are going to look at the current XRP price predictions as well and how they correlate with the Bitcoin price trends that are going on. So please do consider sticking around until the end. But of course first let's look at the Ripple's blockchain news updates. And Ripple has just joined forces with actually three more leading universities expanding its blockchain accelerator program that is called the university blockchain research initiative now this program is shortly uh, named ubri and uh, this time around the university of cape town new york university abu dhabi and uh, ray javik university are the ones that have been added to the list of the company's partners in academia now also we should note that uh, these educational institutions are from three separate continents that is also something very important to notice here because uh, this means that ripple is definitely going global now um, hello guys now uh, for those who are new to the channel please do consider subscribing for daily ripple news updates and ripple price predictions uh, but not only that, we'll also be bringing you daily crypto news updates and crypto price analysis. So do feel free to definitely subscribe to our channel. Now, uh, moving on, um, of course, these universities that I've just mentioned for you will be able to actually conduct research, first of all. They will also be able to host conferences. And uh, not only that, but they will also be able to support blockchain-focused initiatives of their students by basically relying on Ripple's UBRI funding. That's mainly what is going to be happening and uh, also the University of uh, Michigan as well as the Cornell University, also Duke University are among the top universities that have been partnered with Ripple's and of course some of the institutions such as the University of Tokyo also acts as validators as xrp ledger validators now of course originally uh this was launched in june 2018 the ubri and uh, since then it has already sponsored more than 280 research projects uh, mainly um uh, uh, concentrating on the blockchain technology and of course um a guy named as co pierre george who's an uh, associate professor at the University of Cape Town, has actually claimed that Ripple's grant will help to ensure the innovativeness in the country's remittance sector. So their funding actually helps a lot in these research projects, and that is what pushes the innovations in these um, projects and campaign in general. Now, in their own words, Copier Josh said that central banks around the world are studying the use of distributed ledgers to overhaul their payments infrastructure, and nowhere is this more important than in Africa. Of course, with our large remittance sector and high cost of cash, this grant will help us accelerate our activities to create the necessary skills to ensure the innovativeness of our financial service sector. So this is a professor back in Africa talking about how this funding from Ripple is definitely helping their way of um, researching in uh, how um, basically um, central banks around the world are studying the use of distributed ledgers to overhaul their payments infrastructure. So um, it's definitely something very, very nice to see uh, get done. So yeah, kudos to Ripple and kudos to the research teams in these universities as well. Now before I continue, let us look at the price action on the market currently and uh, the global crypto market cap has actually 2.09 trillion US dollars in the last 24 hours. It is increased by 1.34% and also the total crypto market volume over the last 24 hours is actually 145.02 billion US dollars which makes a 3.78% decrease and of course the total volume in DeFi is currently 
1.36 billion US dollars which is at 10.5% of the total crypto market 24 hour volume and uh, also the volume of all stable coins is now 113.59 billion US dollars which is actually 78% of the total crypto market 24 hour volume now when we look at the price of bitcoin bitcoin is actually selling at a price of 54930 US dollars uh, up 0.4% in the last 24 hours and XRP is selling at a price of 1.3 1.37 and it's currently um uh tingling and bouncing around a 0.9% increase and decrease in the price in the last 24 hours we have seen a high price of XRP of $1.45 but it also went down as low as a $1.29 as well so XRP is bouncing up and down but uh, basically when we look at um, the predictions of XRP we definitely have to look at the predictions of Bitcoin first and actually Bitcoin is aimed for a massive 18% upswing and this is of course if key support that are uh, are key support levels that are showing in the charts get to hold and of course since april 23rd just um approximately five days ago uh, bitcoin ha actually uh, bitcoin's price had a major recovery toward fifty five thousand dollar levels and of course bitcoin shifted its momentum in favor of the bulls and uh it actually aims off uh, for a significant 18 percent upswing and that's very nice but this time around we don't expect Bitcoin to match the trend of XRP and XRP of course had a colossal a damaging 44% upswing in the last three days of course and this is after a significant correction down to the one dollar levels we saw the price of XRP fall to as low as 92 cents but of course unfortunately it now seems that investors aren't as interested in XRP anymore despite SEC fears fading away but uh, we do still expect the price to rise at some point up to a dollar 74 cents because that is the next resistance level and uh, after that we do expect the price to fall so look out for that price at the resistance level of a dollar 74 cents when it comes to xrp so yeah thank you very much for watching until the next update bye, -bye.